Georgia corn growers looking forward to the upcoming growing season, and a large number of those growers attended the annual corn short course in Tifton recently. Yeah, the event is full of valuable information that helps corn producers grow better crops and learn about the current economic environment. The Monitor's Mark Wallman has the story. It does not matter how many acres of corn you grow, the annual corn short course can help you produce a better crop. The event brings farmers together with experts in the field to provide corn growers with the latest information. Well, what I'm looking for for all the producers is that they're just going to learn a little bit more about not only the crop production aspect of it and the efficiency, but really how to prevent stress. Because one of the most important aspects of growing corn in Georgia is simply reducing stress and the effects of stress. Georgia corn producers have seen tremendous growth in yields over the years, and a large part of that growth can be attributed to the work being done by UGA Research, the Georgia Corn Growers Association, the Georgia Corn Commission, and many others. The genetic potential of our hybrids are certainly higher than we're able to uh, extract out of it, okay? So uh, what we're beginning to see is that we're getting a greater return every year simply because we're making higher yields. Now, sure, that's going to cost us. Uh, and we have some limitations with water. That's our uh, major asset is that we do have a lot of irrigation. And so short courses like this, getting together, helps growers share and find those little things that can uh, improve uh, the efficiency of their inputs. In attendance at this year's meeting was Dr. Mark Westgate. He is a corn and soybean expert at Iowa State University. He was in town to share information and learn how Georgia producers grow Iowa's most famous crop. Well, Iowa is, is blessed with some deep soils and uh, good rainfall. So, so growing, is not, growing corn is you know, what we're pretty good at there. Here in Georgia, the growers are, are challenged with shallow soils, uh, not much water or nutrient holding capacity in those soils, and boy, they have a lot of pressures from insects and diseases. So growing a high yielding crop is a major, major challenge and an accomplishment. You think about growing 500 bushels here, that's an amazing accomplishment. So I take my hat off to the growers who, who are approaching those kind of yield levels. The bottom line to growing any crop is profitability. And every topic discussed at the meeting was geared to help producers get the most value out of every acre. Along with the corn short course, the annual meeting of the Georgia Corn Growers Association was held, which gave participants additional information and a great chance to network with other farmers. As a, as a person who only grows corn and peanuts, this is kind of an important meeting for me. Uh, unfortunately, last year probably may, was a year that asked more questions than we had answers to answer. So uh, we, uh, we, we, we've been coming every year and, and it's uh, good information, gives us something to think about. Hopefully some of those questions that we had last year we can answer now. Even though farmers are eager for the upcoming growing season, they know there will be some challenges. We would like to see better prices. I don't see that for coming in a couple, for a couple of years. We're just going to have to be conservative and struggle through. Reporting from Tifton, I'm Mark Wildman for the Georgia Farm Monitor.